All right, next up is Joe Schilling, trains at the yard in Los Angeles. He's no doubt going to be a crowd favorite. Uh, you want to talk about this organization actually changing the lives of fighters. I, there's no better example of that than Joe Schilling, who came into Glory 10 at uh, Citizens Business Bank Arena, ended up meeting the number one, uh, uh, help me out here, 11? He's the number one guy, you don't know his name. Artem Levin. Artem! <laughs> Artem Levin, and uh, at the end of three rounds, it was ruled a draw, so it, according to Glory Rule, we went to an extra round. The crowd was on their feet through the whole thing. Joe, needless to say, won that tournament uh, here in California, so he'll be fighting in front of his home crowd coming up uh, on Saturday night. So here again is Joe Schilling. Stitch him up, number two contender in the world. You're on camera doing a bunny ears. <laughs> yeah. yeah, that's true. 24 years old, he still ties bunny ears when he ties his shoe. <laughs> <laughs> on camera. <laughs> no big deal. No big deal. <laughs> Here we go. Take it out. Get that. I slow bunny ears. I hit the bear, eh? I'll slow it down for everybody. Bunny ears. I'll slow bunny ears. Look at this. Sorry. Right. Tape goes over it.
Simon Marcus in the quarterfinals of our eight-man tournament, and uh, there's some history with those two. They have met twice before, and uh, under Muay Thai rules, I know Joe feels like there's unfinished business there and that he's a much different fighter now than uh, he was the last time they met, so we look forward to that in the quarterfinals uh, coming up tomorrow night. And uh, we'll no doubt be a hometown favorite at the forum on Saturday night. Speaking of hometown boys, I just want to recognize uh, the fight professor who's here with us today. Right. Stephen Quadros. He's going to be working with uh, Remy Bonyaski on Boy. the lead up to the paper. And Michael Chavello, the voice. Yes. Yeah, and Tim Hughes. Yes. It's good to have him back. It's good to be back.